With nowhere else to turn to, they seek sanctuary at this church in Ismailia in northeastern Egypt. Entire families have left the town of El Arish in Sinai, fearing for their lives. The situation there is way worse than in Iraq and Syria. We've become scared of our own shadows. We look around us and behind us. We're scared that someone might be walking behind us and shoot us. I have five children. My husband hasn't been able to earn a penny in three months. Every day we hear about someone who was shot or killed. Many here say they left because of the threat made by an ISIL affiliate in Egypt. The armed group released a video this week saying it would step up attacks against cops. A spate of killings has sent panic across the minority Christian community. There are 22 families here now and there will be about 20 more coming soon from Al Arish. At the moment we are trying to find them houses for them as well as blankets and mattresses. The Coptic Church has issued a brief statement condemning the violence and attackers, saying they aim to strike our national unity in the face of terrorism, which has been exported to Egypt from abroad. The message echoes the government's line on security in the region. Since 2013, the military has fought against what it calls terrorists in North Sinai. But many Coptic Christians accuse the government of failing to protect them. Gerald Tan, Al Jazeera.